going on guys here about to get some work done on this cold day so this is scumbag this is a car that would be in the, that's gonna be in the challenge so I'm just here because I gotta finish pulling the motor and I gotta do some work to it still deciding if I'm gonna paint it or not I don't know but yeah, currently my boy schools start pulling most of the stuff out for me to pull the motor. Might pull it today. First and foremost, gotta give a shout out to my boy Santos for the extension for my shifter. I didn't like the one that was on there, it was too short. And I would have to reach out, reach over too much to shift. And he also hooked me up with a steering wheel because this little thing, yeah, it's, it's all fucked up. So. It helped me put a new steering wheel, so I will be putting this on the car. It's a little bit bigger than the one that's on there. I don't like that little small one, but that's what came with the car. But yeah, shout out to Santos. He also helped me put a valve cover so I could put my catch can bungs in it because the, the one that was previously on the car, it was set up kind of weird and yeah. You couldn't get shit on there. So, this is the car. This is the motor. It is a turbo car. And I will be ripping the motor out of the car today. So, I might take the heads off and then um, do the rest. I'm not sure. But um, I got to get the motor out. And I'm also working on another motor as well today I will be ripping the heads off of this motor today to get it ready to put in Glimbert so I can have Glimbert running and yeah it's supposed to be a fun day today but this is scumbag and this is the car that I will be running in the event so not much to it all you know no spectacular work. I do have a lot of work I gotta get done to it now. But yeah, for the most part, this is it. I gotta start taking some stuff off. Um, I don't really have nobody here to video. I'm here by myself right now. So I gotta find a jack and stuff like that to jack it up to take the shift link to jaw so I can pull the motor, trans and all that stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and start taking the other motor apart to get ready. Now the axles are still in there. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and start getting the other motor parts. I can start putting that together and wait for my boy to pull up so I can start pulling this motor. And I also gotta pump the gas out. It's 85 in my tank. So I gotta pump all of that stuff out. So yeah, should be fun. All right guys, my phone died and I didn't know where to record. Um, I pulled the heads off the block. So the heads is off. Finally, this is the block. So it's a it's a H twenty two A one block. So this is gonna be the new block that I'm be using. It's gonna be an A one block with a F twenty B heads. Right now the pistons are uh, not even a little dirty. They a lot of dirty. Let's see if it will focus. Yeah, that's a lot of a lot of carbon buildup. So, yeah, they're a lot of dirty. So now I'm just pretty much gonna see, um, what I wanna find out, uh, I might drive back to my house cause I wanna see is the dome size bigger on my other pistons than they are on this pistons. I'm not sure. It looks like it, but I'm not sure. But I kinda wanna see if it is. Cause if it is, then I'll be taking these pistons out and putting my other pistons in. I don't know. I think I'm overthinking it. That's a, yeah. Nah, I'm not going to do that. That's a lot of work, man. That's overthinking it. I just need to get the car running. But yeah, I, I end up taking the heads off. Um, I'm going to be putting... My battery pack fell. Oh, my God. Uh, I'm going to be putting the other heads on the car. So, yeah, I'm pretty much going to take the transmission off. Take all of that stuff off. And um, pretty much just get ready to put it on in Glenbert so to speak 
um, I might I might take this motor apart as well just to see what went wrong in it I might I'm not sure but I might just take it off and see and then after that I'm gonna jack this up pull the axles take the shift linkage off and I'm gonna pull this motor as well so basically today is just about pulling motors um, that's what I'm gonna be doing I gotta get scumbag ready because where I live at like I said it's already cold it's like 32 degrees today so it's gonna be a cold ass winter so I gotta get back to work I'll keep y'all updated all right guys I'm back uh, I know I'm not supposed to use this but I don't give a shit I just want a Dollar Tree uh, I'm gonna try to clean these pistons a little bit just to get some of this carbon build up off of it and then I'll be putting the heads on there so I'm waiting on my boys Coles and Mike to pull up real quick and yeah I might try to put the motor in the car today and go from there Oh, the camera died the camera didn't die it's going dead it's on 10 percent but uh yeah i'm gonna go ahead and put the camera on the charger and i'm gonna finish cleaning this block or trying to clean it as much as possible but stupid camera dying again i need to hurry and buy a camera soon Man, y'all be careful. All right, anyways, update, 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 quick update, everybody. Uh, my man's school's pulled up. He got to pull his heads off because his head gasket, he think it's bad because he still have an overheating problem. Change his water pump, change the radiator, took the thermostat out, still having an overheating problem. So he's about to pull his heads off. As far as me, look at them. Look at these babies. Uh, I'll be right back. Pistons are clean. Give me a second. Oh, uh, yeah, sorry about that. Uh, like I was saying, block is clean now, so I gotta finish wiping some stuff out of it, then put the heads on there. Gotta go, I'm gonna finish wipe the block out, and then I'm gonna put the heads on there, and then we're gonna go from there. The thermostat? Damn, my phone I do have again. two of these joints sitting over there. I wonder if one of them's got a thermostat. Probably do. I don't know. But really, I can do the thermostat whenever I just need to get this bitch back together before it gets dark. Yeah. Yo, what's up? The one with the intake on it. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, we got the heads off the got GSR. About to put the heads back on. We switch out their gasket already. Got to put the heads on that shit. The motor is still in there. We ain't, we end up in put some other shit happen. So worry about that shit another day. Bro, you still hook, bro. Uh, but yeah, about to slap the heads on here and get it timed and everything get it ready to go that's the head off a of school's motor and uh i'll pull this motor another time kind of had some stuff that came up and i had to finish up that because i don't want to leave it outside in the elements and yeah so soon i'll pull the motor out of that one like i said Shout out to my boy Santos. 
for the shifter, for the steering wheel, and the valve cover. I gotta get the E85 out of this car because um, I literally have a full tank of E85. It should be full, yeah, pretty much. Full tank of E85. So I gotta get it out to store it for the winter time. So, let's see if I got any power still. I guess it's dead, I don't know. <laughs> it might be dead, but yeah guys, that's just a quick update. I'm about to put the heads on. Like I said, I don't have nobody to video, so I'm just doing updates as I go. But uh, yeah, right. All right, so just the heads. So I gotta just take everything out of this and then put it over here. Bro, move that damn cigarette, all right? So, yeah, I got my work cut out. Um, got to put another head gasket on there because the other one got damaged. So, that's what I'm about to do right now. Only if this nigga will record, but he don't want to record. You know, but it's all good, though. I ain't go to school for that shit. I got to look like I want the camera. Nigga. You hear that shit? But, yeah, let me try to find another head gasket because it's, it's getting dark. And yeah, so yeah, let me do that right now. Fuck that.